Okay, so we've identified that there's five main barriers. How many, please? Five, five main barriers to attracting your ideal client. Okay. Number one, it's going to be that word again. Not specific enough. Mm-hmm. Not specific enough, okay? So the key is you've got to solve a specific problem for a specific group of people. So we use the uh, <laughs> May Vu example, how she's this brilliant trainer, training all over the world, you know, making about six figures for CTI, Coaches Training Institute, but then when it came to her own niche, she had four different niches, she could not narrow it down, she was not being specific enough, and then once we worked with her in total niche clarity, we really honed it in on single moms who are dating again. And then, then see, there's see, see yeah, the, how specific, specific that, that is. is right? Yep. Yep. And then, but someone, but you know, it was hard for her to say that because she goes, because I could help the men and I could mm -hmm. help the couples and I could do all that. Mm -hmm. I remember in BNI, there was a gal that said that she was with, um, I think she was with Mary Kay. And she said, I help anyone with skin. Yeah. <laughs> see, and that's what the group would do. I know. And so she would refuse response with results. Yes. They were laughing, but they weren't buying. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that while that had a cuteness to it and it made them laugh, it did not allow them to go, oh, she's, I, I need to be her client. Like anyone with skin, not Too general, specific. Not specific. <laughs> so you're a lot I'm glad of what to you're know that you don't work with dogs. Like yeah. you don't do facials for dogs. Thank you. you know? So I mean, here, like <laughs> here's the thing, you guys. Probably about 90% of what you're focusing on is the wrong thing. Right. You are focusing on irrelevant things that are not going to move the needle in you getting clients. Mm -hmm. They might make you feel great. I loved working on my logo. <laughs> loved it. Could make it pretty. I got better at it. Got really good at PowerPoint. Loved creating PowerPoints. All of that was great. Working on the logo, working on the image, working on the brand. That's all sexy stuff. Mm -hmm. Doesn't make you a dime. Mm -hmm. Okay. So a lot of what you're spending time on is irrelevant. Okay, it's irrelevant to phase one or phase two. Mm -hmm. So if it's relevant to phase three and you're waking up to the fact that it's not in phase one or phase two, now you're hurting. Mm -hmm. Okay, so okay. you gotta learn what really matters. Yeah, you gotta learn what really matters. So leave people out. Leave you're people little, out? Huh? You're, you're a little scared to leave people out. You don't want, you wanna help, you wanna help people. That's why you're in this game. And you don't wanna leave anybody out. You wanna be able to help as many people as possible. But this is a limiting belief that's costing you a fortune.